Hi. If you are interested in our low raw product range, you will probably have noted that our low raw sensors can be used in two distinct modes, the LoRaWAN mode and the low raw proprietary mode. If you want to understand what the differences are between LoRaWAN and low raw proprietary, this video is made for you. Let's dive in. You can use endless sensors in two different ways. The first is to use endless sensors with standard LoRaWAN. Using LoRaWAN R sensors can either communicate with a public or a private LoRaWAN network. This means our sensors can send their data to an operator's cloud or they can communicate with a LoRaWAN gateway. At Endless, we wanted our customers to have another option. This is what we call the Endless Low Raw Proprietary Mode. In this mode, our low raw sensors will communicate with our receivers. The receivers can then be connected to a PLC or a controller via Modbus or BACnet. The low raw proprietary mode is super easy to configure and integrate. Let's go into more details. When using the products in LoRaWAN, you have two options. The first option is LoRaWAN public mode. Our LoRaWAN sensors can communicate with a public network from a LoRaWAN operator. When our devices are positioned in an area covered by a LoRaWAN public network, they can send their data to the operator's cloud. In this mode, you need to have a subscription for each device you want to connect to the operator's cloud. The raw payload is received on the LoRaWAN operator's backend. The data then has to be decoded through an API in order to be processed on an IoT platform. You may, however, want to create your own private radio network. This is what we call the LoRaWAN private mode. In this mode, no subscriptions are needed for the devices. The sensors are communicating with a LoRaWAN gateway. The LoRaWAN gateway can then push the data to a low raw network server or to a building management system. Since LoRaWAN gateways are open and can receive data from any LoRaWAN sensor on the market, you must take into account that you will certainly have to integrate and decode payloads from the LoRaWAN sensors you are using. Most of the LoRaWAN gateways on the market do not natively decode payloads from LoRaWAN sensors. The amount of work involved in the integration can sometimes be quite significant. This is where our next mode makes perfect sense. The endless low raw proprietary mode has been developed to make the integration of our low raw sensors really easy with PLC or controllers. In this mode, you can have up to 40 endless sensors dialoguing with an endless receiver. Radio distance in an open field between the transmitters and the receiver is around 4 kilometers. If needed, signal repeaters can be used to increase the radio distance. The endless receiver natively decodes the endless sensor's payloads. Sensor's data is then converted into a Modbus table or backend objects, so integration with a controller is super easy. Using this mode will save a lot of time for any system integrator. Remember that this is a proprietary mode, and this means our receivers can only dialogue with endless sensors. If you need an open architecture, remember that you can use the LoRaWAN private mode that we described previously. The integration time for a LoRaWAN open architecture with a LoRaWAN gateway will probably be significantly longer. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact our sales team. We will be very happy to tell you more about the possibilities available to you when you use our low raw product range. We hope to hear from you soon. Bye.